Yes, good night, one and all people everywhere. Let me make sure that this first before I go any further. That all right, Life Sweat doesn't own the rights of the music. So, good night, Mama. Season greetings, hoartings. Big up to the German posse. I got the Nubian queen of dance hall, uh, Miss Lady G. Be in in a few. Um, I just want to make sure, big up to all the people in, from uh, we're, we're, we're again, I see so much different people. Hope everyone is having a lovely festive season. I hope everyone is keeping safe and keeping COVID free. Uh, it's most important at this point in time. Uh, flex to the complex, madam me. You know, how the party go on? How the party go on, brother? You no know, party that's supposed to epic in you know, the lineup for the party. It looks vicious, dog. It look, it look how we. I say, savagery go on. I'm mean, gonna so be a savage up on the party. Um, yeah, as I said, we have the Nubian queen of dance all herself, Miss Lady G, and the near named suggest lady, and she's one of the real ladies of the dance hall, like, really keep herself in the fold and act like a lady all the time and every time so me and sister will always big her up <laughs> thanks just need to go to the barber and get my hair cut but uh, lazy all kind of something mother main crew everything all right i dropped some lady g so now that i've made the disclaimer and tagged i made the the, the, the pin um instagram can't really in an argument with me over the music because they Put a restriction on my video with my stream with um with um Frankie's life from last week, and because of that, a lot of people cannot view it from my page. You have to be cleaning it up. Cayman Islands in the building, you know, go. So you know what, Cayman, I, I I know what. Speaking to all the older foundation artists, some of the first the first time I tell them ever traveled. Is actually to the Cayman Islands. So most time when I'm just a test the water, Cayman Islands is one of the first places that actually get to test the waters for the first time when traveling outside on a plane, going on a plane. So we have 45 minutes away. Spaniard, walk one. Be a new song, you know? be a sitting, sitting, so I've linked you because I have some mad new project I work on. We have got shut up on one of them project, a quick and fast, but a problem. January morning, new music, new music, new music, new music coming January morning portion of new music couple really my start out so you know artists you know who me have a link you know my regular crew of artists who I have reach out to so me I say so you know doing the settings for already new music are you ready so me I say um Lady G I'm drop uh let me see which one which one of Lady G I want to drop first there's so much Lady G songs um no I don't want to see that one is it I want the people is it I want to jump up first Lady G that question I mean that question featuring loving dear you eat you cook. <laughs> That's one of the first. That's how they open the rock game. <laughs> it up the brother. You see what I say? So, oh, I understand the mistake. I understand the mistake. Come up fast, quicker, fast. You see what I say? But we already know some of the monster songs, them is no respect, disrespect, no respect. And let G songs them clean. I just remember I always keep it clean over the decades and, and still stay relevant when she wants. To be relevant, I you know sometimes artists them vibe broke. Sometimes that's the next thing where people don't realize what artists sometimes artists them vibes broke because all the industry stays some of the time. You know, say who oh, that summer chills, Jeff Fabulous. You know, bad artist name is you know, Jeff Fabulous, sound like a bad artist name. You know, say bad artist name, Jeff Fabulous. All right, since since this is the song you come up, let me just run with it first. And I know Lady G a brand new, a brand new, brand new music. I know she have some brand new music to talk about as well. As well, that is the next thing. All right, Mister, I drop one song them like um, um, I drop a different. Song. Time to go back and watch the videos. Big up Juke Killer. I hope you take the time to watch back some of them videos, videos from back in the day. So, oh, 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 
all crazy because video was a huge deal in time because not a lot of artists could afford a video. So anything you see, and I like now every man have a camera, every man have a shoot video. Them time your video was such a huge deal when you turn on your TV and see somebody on TV with a music video. It's a huge deal, and this like um in the video, there's also a big superstar female artist in the video as well, um, Shelly Thunder. I think Shelly Thunder, Shelly Thunder. I think Shelly Thunder did back up on this song if I remember correctly. But this was a huge deal. I saw all the unity in the music. Shelly Thunder was a huge artist between Jamaica. I think she's living in New York, but Jamaican. So she used to go back and forth and she had some monster records back in the day. And she was in the video just hanging around and just singing along and stuff like that. So the vibe was just always good in the music back then. But people, if you get a chance, please go revisit some of these videos because it's just funny if you say oh them used to dress and style and, and the swagger that we used to use because Lady G have on a, 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 a pantsuit with a short pantsuit jacket and stuff so it's a whole different style of just in them time so it's good for see stuff like this but now drop around the monster songs them out of catalog right the rhythm sweet we could have played the whole rhythm whole night and, and don't be tired rhythm the rhythm just sweet and she just sit down upon the rhythm and just glide upon the rhythm because it's very laid back and this rhythm was a monster rhythm. Rumors, um, it was called, I think it was called Rumors rhythm. Rumors them spreading. They have um, telephone love on it and some, some, some monster record was on this. And this this juggling here was a smooth, silky smooth, right away, people. So, I say so. Um, I'm going to play our next uh, skin at, uh, scratch me for play it back one more time. I'm going to play one more little G because have a new song that's out right now. And this official audio has just been released, like probably last week, or last week, probably week and the weekend. This song was released. It's called No Problems, and um, I definitely have to play it first before she come on. I kind of vibe to it. She's still active. She have her own label. She's still doing a lot of production here and there. And um, our kids, them, of course, are very talented in, in the music field as well. So this is something new. What she have? I don't sure if she produced this one. But I'm gonna drop it and then if you don't want me can drop back more this free, no no free spec cause the rhythm's so sweet and everything. But we drop that one here first and then we can get everything into gear. In the meantime, in between time, share the light. <laughs> good night, good night, good night, good night. Good night, good night, good night. You know me yes, so you know me not used to them something. Yeah? Yeah. You know me not used to this. <laughs> <laughs> it's the way of the future. This is the way to I'm go. Telling you, especially that's... with COVID going around now. Yeah. Especially get COVID, with it, you know? this is it, 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 it's really it's a good way to pass time and still get to all a joy the same way and see True. everybody face to face without True. being in contact with everybody in a room. Yeah, that makes sense for real. Yeah, we have to <laughs> we have we have to keep the music vibes going. We can't make it dead, you know. Cause music is here to live forever. So we have to find a way. So yeah, uh, yeah. the the, the new band Queen of Dancer. Really? That, that is what I'm talking to them again. That is one of, one of the words that was this used to describe you. You say, yo, Thank you. no, Lady G, she, uh, she yeah. aged well, like you know her age. Sure. I always keep herself <laughs> nice and clean, lovely black skin. Thanks, man. And thanks. we can easily say, like one of the queens of dance, because you have proven that you are one of the queens of the journal. Yeah, mama. You've been doing it for a long time. Man. And still yeah. doing it. Still yeah. doing it. Yeah. Timeless yeah, music man. as well, the classics. I, I, I started to play. Um, no respect, <laughs> and it felt like a new record. Wow, I That's feel like good. I could have played. I feel like I could have played all night and, and don't get tired of it. And the rhythm is yeah. so sweet, and yeah. oh, you just flowing and the rhythm like water. Real authentic music, man. Live music it will live forever. Yeah, man. Uh, good musician. One of the, one of the best set of musicians them from out of Jamaica, Steely and Cleavy and Danny Brownie. Yes, yeah, man. Ma Dalton Brownie also. Yeah, rest in peace. You have like um, Dean Fraser. Yeah, all them people, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, it feel, it feels sweet. It feels sweet. It feels sweet. Because yes, the rhythm was, yes. it was a juggling couple song. I think it was called the Rumors Rhythm. I know that. Rumors Rhythm produced yeah. by Gussie Clark. Yeah, Gussie man. Clark, yeah, yeah. Yep. Then I got it right. I got it right. I said Gussie yeah, Clark. Man, and good, Rumors man, and good. Good. Telephone yes. Love, I think, was on that record. as on that rhythm too. What if I it sang up on a rhythm, though, man? Holy if I it the sang Monster on a Records. Rhythm, yeah. Monster yeah, man. Records. Yeah. And, and, and that show you how dance is such a versatile thing as well. That a man yeah. can build a rhythm and, and vice five artists and a rhythm. 
And yeah. Five, them are five different style melodies, five different sort of flow. Yeah. And they sound them just lovely. Yeah, that's how, that's how um, the music's supposed to be. Creative. Creative. But to tell the truth, <laughs> to tell the truth, dance all music, we have to give ads off to the man that we set this thing here. Yeah, man, definitely. Because yep. lots of different, mu like a lot of different genres of music. Yeah. Around the world, the people have a rhythm. And if a man I do a remix and I try, do one next melody on it. Yeah. Once him hear the melody that was on it originally, then yeah. can't hear a next yeah, melody. Yeah, yeah. That's stuck in them head, yeah, for real. Stuck in them head. So yeah. even for you for, know the thing as a writer, also, Kofi. And somebody <laughs> said that to me because somebody so, like one of my friends, them that writes, write a lot yeah. of music. Look at me, I said, I said, I said, I said, you might, you might take it for nothing and take it for granted. I yes. say, yo, I know I'm a great writer. I write a lot of hit songs. But I say, yo, I see you do it more than once. Like, write a song and I read him and then park it and write a next song and then write a next song. You yeah. say, listen to me. Once I don't write the first song from the rhythm, I can't hear right. no more. Another no melody. No <laughs> more melody. Nothing else can come back to him, brother. Nothing come back yeah. to him, brother. So yeah. We take it for granted just, you know, say, we do it in such a way, just dance all do it in such a way we can't find it. Yeah man. yeah man for real for real that's how, and that's different how it melody works. and different yeah. flow yes that's how yeah, unique we are as, yeah, a, as, a, as, a, as a yeah we are very unique and we don't yeah. realize how, how great Definitely. we are we don't want, talented yeah. creative unique and a lot of us we don't have to go on a music school they learn nothing it just Not comes natural. natural so that's what yeah. you call talented naturally it does naturally you know in a yo yeah man right. One thing I'm going to need for you, though, I'm going to see if you can handle your camera so we can see all of it. Yeah, all of it. Ah. Okay, because I okay. you don't want the fans them to beat me and say, oh, I'm going to show a quarter. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> you know okay. why? Me I get know, responsible for that. <laughs> I know, so, you know, so I'm going to set up the thing right, but but I wait for you so long for, for, for getting in touch with me. I'm going to... Tears the whole well, thing. Well, yeah, because right. I'm going to look at the thing when I can, can put my, my camera in, but you know, I, I, I the younger one, they must help me. So. All right. So, so you know what? what? You know what we can do? You know what we can do? We can give you five minutes yes. to organize yourself <laughs> and get comfortable. Because I want it to be, be extra. Yeah, I'm comfortable, man. I'm comfortable. I'm comfortable. I'm comfortable. I'm comfortable, man. Really okay. relax. Yeah. But I just hold the camera steady. Yeah, and I'll get, yeah, and I'll get yeah. tired eventually. Yeah. Believe yeah. me. <laughs> the only time you get tired is when you walk up and down. When you walk up and right, down. Right, 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 right. But when you sit down, it's a whole different story. All right. When I got my daughter, set it up in anything. So I'm not going to do a lot of look for it. That's what I have. <laughs> so, yes, eh? so we're yes. going to play about no problem and stress one more time. Yes. And then I'm going to play about enough respect and play two more songs that I read in by that you're supposed to be ready, ready, ready. All right, all right, all right. Perfect, perfect. <laughs> yeah, man, perfect. yeah, man, good. All right. Yeah. All right, people. Don't worry. Lady G is around, so I don't want any stuff in the fridge. Don't, we don't have no problems, we don't have no stress. I'm going to play about this brand new song from Lady, Lady G for 2020. Song, while she get our, our, our computer stand, our, our stand for our phone. So she can get very comfortable so we can start the discussion. So I'm going to play about this song one more time. I'm going to play about No Respect and play two more songs on the rhythm. Because the rhythm is so sweet. Sweet like sugar. See? So I'm going to play about the song one more time. And by that record, it's sweet. I just played three songs on the rhythm. I know everybody's skin. Everybody yeah. feels nice right now. Right now it's like they don't want to dance with your picnic. It just That's feels true, sweet. I know, I know, me have to big up um, Mikey Bennett for that song there because Mikey Bennett was definitely the, the person who was doing the taking the voice okay. at the time, yeah. On to Mikey, was, man. Yeah, man. Great yeah. job. And, and I mean, I DJ that song so many times. Mikey, sorry for me. He said, Go well, drink some water and come back. He <laughs> 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 said, I don't have no bottle of water. You go straight out the pipe. I oh got a cooler and go drink some water and come back. <laughs> yeah, man, big up to Mikey Bennett, man. For real. Uncle Mikey, man. Uncle Mikey. One of the legends mm. in the game. Yeah, um, man. Another that, legend. I yeah. One of these nights, them. I don't want to do these nights at Uncle Mikey. I have to come on alive in you know? him. Yeah, man. You have to um, talk to him, man. He have a whole heap of story about the music industry, man. For real. Yeah, yeah, my Uncle Mikey. Like, yeah. Anytime I need no help with anything, Uncle Mikey is one of the first person can become. And you know what cool face is a good thing you're doing. Cause I guess what all those people you need to get the history from them, them experience. 
Because them man, they have a whole heap of experience. No, no, Uncle Mike, Mike, Mike is somebody, Uncle yeah. Mike is somebody we're going to sit down and reason with over the years. And, yes, man, yeah. just that now, but kind of documented by us doing it yes. on a public yes. platform. Because this, yes. this is, for me, this is what, yeah. I tell people, it's not really an interview. It's just like, when I want to go to the studios and I book up the artists, and I will start reason about several reason. stuff. Reason, yeah, man. This for is real. just what it for is. Real. We're just going to talk about stuff. For but now we're doing it in a, a public platform yes. where other people outside the circle yes. can hear some of this stuff. Then. Yes. But one night I was on live and I hear um, somebody was talking to Dean Fraser and I was like, oh shit, Dean Fraser did so much work. You know what I mean? I know he did a lot of work, but yeah. you know, when he might tell me the, the walk, when I'm walking you know, and music, I'm like, wow. I didn't yeah. know all of that, even though I know Dean Fraser over all these years. You yeah, know, Uncle Dean. All of that. Yeah, man. Uncle Dean knows. So my time I get the stores and find him sometimes I play a domino. Yeah. Just, like, like, just so COVID didn't come up, I you have to see him because the whole COVID vibe. Yeah. But yeah. once you start playing domino, you have to ask him a whole pack of things because yeah. him, him get free to play for my favorite artist of all time, which is Dennis Brown. Oh, okay, yeah, man. He yeah, play man. for Dennis Brown yeah, and man. play for Bob. So him have the stores and we're so long and reasonable. Yeah, tell him. Yeah, man, for Tours real, them. for real, for real. Tours them nice. So I enjoy Like for me, this one me I do, I enjoy doing it so much because yeah, every time I do it, I learn something new. Yeah. Same time the people might learn something new, me I learn yeah. something new. Yeah, yeah, for real. And it's for just, real. It's just one of them vibes that I feel just, I feel just give thanks say, yo, I have that opportunity yeah, to do it and I know enough people can connect the dots. Yeah, but man. you, when I just started, I, earlier stages, I've interviewed and reasoned with two females. One yeah. is Danny Boo, who is a new dancer artist, dancer turned dancer artist, Danny Boo. Yeah. And I spoke to Tifa. Okay. But since it's been like official, Seeing. I have been wanting to fine tune and find the right female artist and to, to, to talk to and right. reason with on a level. And, and I was saying to Red Water, Red Water, that's a warm, tear, cool face. Just so the world will find G, man. Me find G for you right man. now, man. Okay, okay. All the time. Cause... One thing with the Main Street crew, we keep the link, man, because we have family, you know? Not because, yeah. you know, we, we, we know. They are one place now, but we are family. Yeah. We still keep the link same way, man. Big up to Red Rat. <laughs> yeah, and as a man, we always, Rat them is. always reason on a regular basis. We message me, and we message him, and we just yeah, reason on a whole lot of different things. And, and the vibe is always good, so it's you know, so it good that everybody good keep, the, good keep the vibe going, all, all the vibe is going still. Good deal. But, um, so, I don't even know where to start, where to start, where ah. to start. <laughs> all right, no, so, all right, let me start from, all right. Mm. Give us some of your upbringing. Take us, take us to the early stages. Well, um, born in Spanish Town. Mm -hmm. um, to be exact, Thompson Penn. And then moved to De La Vega City. Ooh. Yeah, in Spanish Town. And then, you know, I'm still in, I'm still in, in Portmore, same way. So I reside to Portmore. Yeah. Yeah, it's still there send catching. Yeah, okay. Europe, yes, still send catching, yeah man. So I mean what can I say? It's so much so much things are coming on me right now, but yeah. Well, well well I've to let the people know that um I'm from a musical background, even though my father never really make it that big in the business, but a lot of people really like, you know, know who me read at all, but like like um not Robbie, Sly, Robbie, the bass yeah. player, Robbie, because my father played bass also. But my father now work out with the Congos. That's who he's, he's singing with right now and touring with. His name, okay. is, his name is Ken Wright Five, and I'm calling him Crimo. Yeah, so as a little girl growing up um, in Spanish Town, Chins Avenue at the time, because, you know, when you're living at the ghetto, you're a whole party friend, lane, 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 lane. So I was in living in Chins Avenue, you know, Wolfman live a whole road over there, so, and, yeah. and, and little loot and fire, little tiny loot and a little, little, little you know, you. <laughs> over for a whole road, it's like a whole road, a place where you used to keep a whole for big dance and a loot and fire, loot and pe um, yard, there, so, so, it's like me now living at Chins Avenue the next day, because I hear everything while going over there, so, every big sound, you can't think of, volcanoes, telegraph, all them sound, them time, so, me, I grew up, I listened to them dance and all of them things, you know, me, they, me can walk from Thompson Penn, go prison oval, you know, prison oval was the place where you used to keep bully for big dance, you know it, what I mean? It, so <laughs> it's, sad, it's, it's sad that I don't say at the parties, 
I thought dance not keep I thought dance not keeping in prison over anymore. I don't know why. Yeah, there's a reason for it because of the hospital. And the, oh, the, okay. noise, the noise abatement thing, yeah. The hospital, so it's like them stop it completely. And then you have a police station across from it also. So the police station wasn't there before. It was up in Spanish town more, but because the, the police station is there also, them just scrap everything. Them can't keep no more dance. They say it's mostly like mostly like uh, football match and them kind of thing they can't keep over there. Yeah, but growing up, I remember I used to, um, well, my mother is a single parent, so, but I used to go and visit my father time after time, and when I got there, I used to always see him have a whole other instrument, conga drum and guitar and, and them little thing there. So, growing up with the knowledge that my father is a musician, it's like, I don't know, automatically, he's like, we just get, find the love for yeah. music, you know, and... Going to school, I used to always get involved in all kind of activities, dancing, running. It was just like a little nuffy them time there. <laughs> so, you know, singing, anything at all. You know, that's that's where, when I find myself, start really gravitating to music, really. You know what I mean? And which, and then, which school was this? Which one? High school? Primary school? No, I was going to Crescent All Eight School in Spanish Town at the time. Okay. Yeah, and then now when I start going to school in Kingston now, it's the same thing. I used to go to St. Joseph High School, it's a private high school, and then to Dunoon Technical High School, and then time there's like, we start taking on the music, you know, really serious. Uh, well, how it really started, <clears throat> well, you know, me, I do my little thing in the community, we have a little community sound, and, you know, make a bag of knives and all them something there. So, yeah. but it really started when they have a a big thing in a Spanish town, you know, every August they used to have the festival sh yeah. um, road shows. Yeah. 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 So they wanted a female to come up, come DJ. So me, you know, with my enough self, run gone up, them friend them, and my cousin them boots me up. I said, come on, man. Because I'm always here, me, I'm look a 4 4 line, and, you know, I'm look a, <laughs> <laughs> I'm look a hit bars, them, I see. So they say, yeah, man, go on up there. I'm going to go up there, I'm going to go DJ, and, Daddy Miki them, you know Daddy Miki them, right? Little Miki and Daddy Miki, yeah. Right, Daddy Miki was in the audience and he come to me and say, you know, your sound good enough, I can bring it to a sound at Kingston, you know, 30 Edley Avenue, you know, Black Scarp, you know. And I said, what? Where them used to play the every Thursday night. You know, me I tell her from in the 80s, me I tell her about early 80s. And Unstoppable TV. Yeah, I'm a just... And from that, we got Black Scarpy and start doing my thing. Every Thursday night, we used to just go there, just to get a whole half of mic and thing. And then after a while, I just become a household artist, um, DJ for Black Scarpy song. Yeah, yeah, Black Scarpy is one of the real yeah, champions man. of dance half. I'm sound to produce it. Yep. And the first time I really get to go like a country dance, really, I ask Black Scarpy to come ask my mother permission for go. Because I said, why? But yeah, T4 for go so far because me now I get to coming back before the light. So I mean, I want you to worry about me. <laughs> so let me ask this. Let me ask this important question. In your era of dancehall, because I interview most of the men in the dancehall um, yeah. industry, most like because I started out of sound in the earlier days, yeah. one never used to do the car. All I would go through, you have to jump and chuck back and. Yeah, and anything that the earliest they are driving in the front of the truck or whatever. What's your first that experience going to the country? My first, you know, I hear it. <laughs> Don't right. tell me, say you had to see it when we go. When we go, me me tell Scarpia say me want to forget the country dance. I'm say here what Scarpia the feel away. Let me tell the story. <laughs> Scarpia <laughs> say, all right, here we have to go do. I could come up at 30 Edley Avenue. Remember, I say a Spanish town I live now, you know. So I take the yeah. bus from a 30 Edley Avenue. And Scarpa said, So you can catch the truck to go away when the truck I leave out. So I have to come in early for an evening. I say, So really? So, I have to come. I have to come. I come. come in the evening. Come in the evening. And I have to say to General Trees, 
bless up General Trees anyway. Them. Big up Trees, General Trees, Trees, yeah. Original Marvel, man, too. Yeah. Yeah, man. I said, Trees, you know, say, Scott, you say, you know, I'm coming early so I can roll with the Chuck Black coach. And I said, no, my man. Go for which Chuck. Yeah, I roll with the weed out of here. So I saw me escape the Chuck Black. Oh. <laughs> Big up General Dreams one more time for General Dreams. Yeah, well, that's so how they escaped the truck back one. Oh, yeah. Go see, go see, good, good. <laughs> Where am I the name again? Where am I the name? Devon. <laughs> Devon, what am I the name, man? Devon. D E V O N. Yeah, man. Devon. Miss yeah. Devon, good, good daughter, another pan truck back. Pan truck back, no. I got country. No, sir. Uh, <laughs> God. Uh. So from that, you know, Sam, again. We get for driving I care, you know, my status, you know, <laughs> change. <laughs> See it? Yeah, man. Still... Yes, man. Big up General Trees once again. So, all right. Since I'm the first time I go country, tell us about that dance. Why? Mm. Cool face. You want me to listen to what I'm secret now? <laughs> no, I'm telling you. Okay. Listen, the first this time I got dance, so I want to tell you. This is live uh, trips. That's what this is for, you know. Daddy Miki again play another part tonight. We go West Milan. And you know them say West Milan have the best herbs, no? <laughs> so we go West Milan. And they and Daddy Miki say, Daddy Miki be like me for him, say, hold up, split for me, G, I'm a holy, but I don't know what it is. They are my from, from the weed, does hit me, I'm just saying, I'm just start one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, four. <laughs> when, 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 when now Daddy Miki say, G, where is split for me? I don't know. So then now all I know, I just find like some little man in my head up this and uh, do some disconnection and all I am some there and friend. Who could it be Jerry Knight? Who could it be Jerry Knight? We start fretting on me and say, Jesus Christ, look how now me go. Big scrap and ask somebody, I forgot this country dance and they know me come at this country dance and go smoke weed and get mad. I said, you know, star. And scrap and start cuss. Me care first member, first member let her listen up from me. Scarpia start cuss. Little me can say, Who you gonna give people and pick me? Who you gonna smoke for? And you know, so far, I don't miss on Ganja baby boy. I don't smoke anymore right now, still, but. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man, I'm gonna DJ the night. I'm gonna DJ the night. Yeah, man. But I have a whole lot of other country experience like that. I mean, <laughs> got some country dance. I'm going to go to the world. I'm going to go to the world. I'm going to go to the so I'm asking about it. I'm going to go to the Yep. So you like the, the hundreds of dancehall artists in the eighties and nineties started off from the sound systems. Yeah. Give us some of the sound systems that you started off from. I know Jack Scarpia is one of them. You say. Black Scarpia, Black Scarpia creation is one of them. from Spanish Stone. Yeah. Um, another song from Montego Bay named African Symbol. Mm -hmm. And I used to DJ on another song named Destiny from out of Manchester. That's how I get to know Garnet Silk and Tony Rebel because them time there. Tony Rebel and Garnet Silk I come and dance and watch me a DJ. <laughs> yeah. Yep. yep. And um, which other song again? And you know, yeah, you used to have a whole heap of that song where we used to go make some little cameo, you know, feature yeah. upon it. But yeah, those songs was the song like when we just called a while ago. Yeah, have another creation song is a monster song. Is a GT2, monster. where Papa San used to DJ, and it's a Spanish song. So Spanish song, yeah. Yeah. And GT, I have a song, another song from Jews Land, the name GT2. Yeah. Owned by a virgin called Altiman. Pass and all. So I used to DJ upon them song frequently, but Black Scarpia was my original song. Yeah. All right, so the first big dance now where you get, all right, you say you go country, but I want the first big dance when you get your first call up because I heard stories of man I say, yo, them there dance and feel somebody I pull them pants foot or somebody yeah. I say, yo, give me a bus and give me a talk for the mic. What was your first instance where you're going to dance and, 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 and somebody say, yo, I call the artist here. I'm going to come DJ a song or something like that. I oh, have so much experience, but it's like, like to remember one specific, it's kind of hard. But um, 
I want if I I want if I contract but but toward the world fourteen parishes before me start go for it. <laughs> for so funny enough, when yeah. you say toward the world fourteen parishes, you know, people might take it as a joke, you know. But there's so much place in this yeah, place man. as small as Jamaica may be. You have some place in this place. Yeah. When you yeah. when you go, you feel like you're in one different country, you know. But Mandeville and 